morning students i am nilam ma'am from sca public school students today i am going to teach you chapter number 5 that is understanding elementary shapes today i am going to teach you about 3d shapes okay i think you have seen this page of your notebook have you seen this this page of your notebook yes this is 2d or 3d yes it is 2d because it has length and breadth only it has only length and breadth so a rectangle square these will be called 2d shapes and when we talk about these uh shapes like that this cylindrical type and you look at this uh, ludo dice yeah you can see this ludo dice yes you see these shapes you see your mobile yes and some more things here this is what is the shape of this yes this shape is what cylindrical this shape is cylindrical and your book math book yes your math book what is the shape of your math book yes or that is cuboid and when you look at this box when you look at this box what is what do you will call this it is a cuboid it is called cuboid and this ludo dice here this ludo dice it will be it will be called what q it will be called q so and these types of shapes and your geometry box also that is also cuboid yeah, and this book also this book this is also cuboid why we call uh, this cuboidal because it yes cuboidal because it has length breadth and height also and height also similarly of about this box i can say this is the length this is breadth and this is the height this is the height so that's why this is called 3d shapes this is called 3d shapes you can see your geometry box also that is also a cuboid that is also a cuboid the object which has length breadth and height those are called 3d shapes so today our topic is 3d shapes three dimensional we can say three dimensional shapes so here when you talk about this here what is this yes what is this this is globe you already know this model of our earth so this sphere this is called a sphere this is called a sphere this is also here we call this as 3d this is also a 3d shape okay and when you enjoy that ice cream cone cone that is also one of the example of 3d shapes so 3d shapes are here what i have shown you object also and this is the shape of what this is the shape of a cuboid this is called a cuboid okay then when you talk about this ludo dice it has length breadth and height equal length breadth and height of yes this ludo dice is equal that's why it is called q it is called q so when we talk about q then all the sides are of equal length so length breadth as well as height we can say so this is we can say this is q you should be able to draw the pictures also and brick you 
see brick brick this is four this is brick it has also length breadth and this height length breadth and height so all these are not 2d we call this 3d because it has length breadth and height so that's why these are called 3d shapes so cone is also here cone cone this is cone then we talk about sphere and this this is also globe is also a sphere so how can we how can we draw it in? it is a sphere look a a ball also example of a sphere then prism prism also pyramid also these all are they have examples of what 3d shapes these are 3d shapes and cylinder also there i have shown you this object this is cylindrical this is cylindrical and wheel of the road roller are in cylindrical shape in cylindrical shape here this is circular from the top and bottom this is cylinder this is called cylinder and this yes this is my geometry box <laughs> for keeping mathematical instruments and you also are having a uh, geometry uh, geometry box with you that is also cuboidal that is also cuboidal it has length this breadth this breadth and this height this height so this is also cuboidal your geometry box is also cuboidal in shape okay so these are here examples of what 3d shapes 3d shapes then comes pyramid pyramid a solid shape with a polygonal base and having other faces as triangular triangles meeting at a point is called a pyramid a solid shape with a polygonal base means base is made up of line segments it it can be base triangular or uh, square in shape and having other faces as triangles as triangles meeting at a point is called a pyramid then it, here cone cone is a solid with a circular base it has a flat surface at the base it and other faces is curved it has no straight edge it has no straight edge so its base is here circular and curved it is also curved it is also curved and about cylinder why what we can say about cylinder it is a solid cylinder is a solid cone having two circular bases and a curved surface it has no straight edge it has two flat surface surfaces it has two flat surfaces like this is also flat this is also flat and this is curved this is curved one curved surface and two here flat surfaces of what cylinder this is cylindrical shape i am showing you then a sphere solid sphere has curved surface only it has no flat surface and no straight edges 
So it is a curved surface. This globe, this globe, it has only curved surface. Only curved surface. Curved surface. So here we can say examples of 3D shapes are cuboid, cube, cuboid, cube, cone, sphere. This is also sphere. Cylinder, pyramid, pyramid also. So these are what? These are called 3D shapes. 3D shapes. And in your real life, you will find many uh, objects which are three dimensional. Three dimensional. And when you will learn about their faces, edges, and vertices, let's uh, learn about it here. What is it? Suppose here, first of all, about faces. So this is a box. Okay. So how many faces? This is the first face number one. Face number two. Face three. Face four. Face five. And face this complete face. So it has six faces. A cuboid. A cube. It has what? Six faces and what what about edges 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 are here one two three four then five six seven eight nine ten eleven and this is twelve so total twelve edges and when we talk about corner, when three edge, one, two, and this three edge meet at a point, then corner is formed. Corner is formed. So this is corner. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, and eight. So there are eight corners of a cuboid and a cube. Okay. Then, this all, you already know, it has one curved surface and one flat surface of four. And it is, sphere has only curved surface, it has no edge. Then, about cylinder, it has two plane surfaces and one curved surface. One curved surface. So, in exercise 5.9, you will match. First, we, first is, first will be matched with what? Yes. It will be matched with second, cone. Will be matched with second, cone. B, sphere, will be matched with? Yes, sphere, four. Cylinder, cylinder will be matched with fifth figure. Cuboid, will be matched with third third figure and pyramid it will be matched with first with first okay so here question is you will give new, uh, two new examples of each shape when you talk about cone so examples of cone are yes an ice cream an ice cream cone and a birthday cap an ice cream cone and a Birthday cap. So examples of cone. Examples of cone. Cone and ice cream. You have to write two cone. An ice cream cone and a birthday cap. And a birthday cap. And mandy cone also. That is also cone. Then about sphere. For about sphere what you can say. A cricket ball and a tennis ball. A cricket ball and a 
tennis ball and a tennis ball then third is cylinder cylinder it is a road roller a lawn roller a lawn roller or a road roller a lawn roller or a road roller a road roller then after cylinder what is other it is cuboid cuboid you can give many examples um, a brick a match box a brick a match box cuboid yes this is these are the questions from your chapter number 5 exercise 5.9 okay a brick a match box then pyramid so pyramid of egypt and a diamond that is also pyramid in shape pyramids of egypt You can write different examples also. Okay. You can write different examples also. Then question number two of exercise five point nine is what shape is your instrument box? Yes. What is the shape of your instrument box here? That is cuboid. And a brick. Yes. A brick. That is also a cuboid. That is also a cuboid. Then third is um, a matchbox that is also cuboid, cuboidal in shape. A road roller that is cylindrical, and a sweet ladoo. I think your mouth will be watered. <laughs> a sweet ladoo that is also example of what? A sphere. That is example of a sphere. Okay, students, you will complete this exercise 5.9 of NCERT book in your notebook. Homework. Do exercise five point nine. Okay. Till then, stay alert, stay healthy, and mask yourself. Take proper care. Thank you. God bless you. Thank you.